Once you've completed processing payroll, paying payroll liabilities, and printing off your paychecks, you can run reports to verify the payroll information or simply just to keep for your records. To run a payroll report, go to Reports from the main menu at the top, Payroll, and then select the corresponding payroll report that you would like to see. The payroll summary report is the most commonly used report to see how much each employee was paid for a specific pay date and the overall company payroll amount. If you would like to see this report for a specific pay date, make sure that your from and to date represent the paycheck date, not the pay period. Check off the employees that you would like to see. And then click Preview. The employee that you're viewing the report for will be listed in the top left-hand corner. Your date range will be listed at the top. The payroll summary report will then group information together by earnings, gross deductions, adjusted gross pay, taxes, net deductions, and employer liabilities. Since my date range is the actual paycheck date, I'm seeing the earning information and the taxes and liabilities that were calculated on this specific paycheck. To see the total amount for the company, skip to go to the last page. All employees will be noted in the top left-hand corner. All earnings will be listed with the total gross pay. Gross deductions with the total gross deductions. Taxes with the total taxes. Net deductions with the total net deductions. Additions, if any were and employer liabilities. This report is very helpful to see specific information for what was calculated on a specific paycheck date. You can also run this report for the month to see the total payroll amount for the month or for the quarter. For more information about the payroll summary report, click F1 to read the help topic on the payroll summary report.